So now we're gonna discuss um, the setup and of the PVA20 and the A30. Right here we have is what we call the PVA30. And the difference between the PVA20 and the A30, that the A30 has a regulator for the vacuum and the PVA20 just has for the hold and eject. Okay, but um, right now what we have is the PVA30. So we take this out the box, set it on your lap paste. Um, the second kit is a what we call the Pico Nozzle Kit. Okay, the Pico Nozzle Kit is um, you receive two of these with each system, and it consists of different components to do you either your holding of the cell or um, injection. Okay, so what is included is some tubing that you will cut to accommodate. You also receive. Um, the but it's actually called the Pico Nazo kit to hold your pipette, the acrylic body, and a, and a bar, 8.4 millimeter bar, so you can put on your manipulator. And you also have a set of gaskets, okay, um, to accommodate depending on the outer diameter of your uh, glass. Okay, you have a little sheet here that tells you um, what is the um, depending on the um, outer diameter you will use the, the color that is required, okay? And that's what's included with the Pico Nozzle Kit. Right? The second thing is the um, connection kit. Okay, with the connection kit, you receive this um, adapter here to put onto your um, pressure source, your pressure tank, okay? Um, with that, you also receive another adapter for your vacuum source. This is only for your vacuum source. I just want to make sure that you understand that we only recommend that you use nitrogen, air, or CO2. Never use oxygen when you're doing these injections. And the second thing that you, that you get is this hard tubing that you can cut to accommodate the size of um, the length that you need. 